Okay, and we'll and we'll talk. If I get the ball out here on the fingers, it's gonna go. Everywhere. Right, right. So we're gonna work on uh, serves today with John. It's about uh, 70 degrees right now. Pretty good weather. It's pretty good motion. It's pretty good motion. He just got to the finals of the Sunland Springs Villa Sunland Springs Mixed Doubles Tournament and just trying to work with him on some serves and trying to get him more linear instead of more non-linear instead of linear. So I'm just showing, he's just showing us some uh, beginning serves and then we'll, we'll move on from there. It's a good motion, looky looky though. He watched it go right in the net. Can't move your head. Yes, well, you moved your head. Very good. So now we so, practice a little bit. Now we're doing a first serve. We're tossing the ball at the 45. Remember your, remember your non-linear motion. Good, that was better. Now, you're going to see it in the video. That was a total looky. Keep your head up. Very nice. You kept your head up, and you looked right at the ball. Very nice motion. Relax. No, nope, miss hit the ball, so you really weren't looking at it, but it was still a solid serve. Do, uh, second serve. uh, yeah. Let's grab four balls, though. I want to see four balls with your second serve. And remember, this one tosses over your head, directly over your head. Let it drop a little bit, and then brush up. Not bad. That was more slice than topspin. You got to go up, up the back of the ball, up, up. That was not bad. There it is. That was a pretty good topspin kick. Again, you got to be relaxed. Don't even hit that. That was not, if, it, if the toss isn't in the right spot, you can't hit it. But we're not trying to slice. We're trying a topspin well, kick yeah. second serve. I understand what you're saying, but you got to learn to just catch it. I didn't like that toss. Directly over your head. That was more for a flat serve. Over your head. Over your head and hit up. There it is. That was it. Now, the more you get used to that, and I'm going to send you a video with this, then all of a sudden the ball kicks in the opposite direction that most people think. Now we're looking at the forehand full stroke and let's go in the alley cross court, completely cross court. Quit looking up. Well, that's total look up. Don't look, don't look. Very good. Now we need to get that ball deeper and more penetrating and in the alley. Well, relax. So what's, show me what it looks like at the bottom of your stroke. Right at the bottom. Stop. Now go forward just a little. Stop. Now, see you're locked up in your wrist. Drop your racket head. There we go. Way down there. Yes, that's under the ball. Now show me your stroke without the ball. Yes. That's the stroke. That's the stroke. Do it again. Now, that was a muscle. You were squeezing the grip. You were trying to help it. Remember, your arms, your arms a whip. Whip it. There we go. That's money. Down, down. Grab some more balls. Yes. Now, tell me how much effort that took. And was that flat and topspin, pretty much? Little flat, little topspin. But on this shot, you really don't want any topspin. Why? Because topspin slows the ball down. You want this to get through the court as fast as you can. Very nice. Now, it got a little lower than you anticipated. 
you didn't make the adjustment. This has to be higher so you can hit down. Down, down, try four more. So we're doing backhands now. Did you look up? Yes, you did. Now, you're trying to kill snakes. Show me a stroke where you just use your centrifugal force and whip your racket, move your racket like a whip. Show me, I wanna see it and hear it. Yes, now relax more. Very good, let's do it. Good, now you did, well, what happened? You didn't hit it in the center string, so you took your eye off the ball. Beautiful. Now breathe. What does breathing do? It helps you to relax and makes your arm more of a whip. Beautiful, beautiful. Well, how high did you project it? How high over the net did that go? So if you're gonna hit it hard, you better learn to hit it a half a foot over the net. Do you want that pace on your shot? Heck yeah. Now hit it a half a foot over the net. Uh, it hit the, hit the seam in the court. I'll move back. Beautiful, do it again. Breathe out. Good, do it again, do it again. Now hit it in the center string, so look at the ball. Look at the ball, look at the ball, look at the ball. Don't move your head as you hit it. Your head stays at the 45. That was a bad toss, my fault. Good. Now quit looking up. Quit looking up. Now drop under the ball. Show me drop under the ball. Yes. Now show me whip. There you go. Relax. All along your back. I'm going to write you a prescription. Send it to uh, Audrey that she has to give you a back massage. <laughs> As you got some major tightness going on. Beautiful, now look at that power. Would you like to use that? Now that was a miss hit and your thumb is cre your, your thumb is creeping back up there again. That was a beautiful stroke. Breathe out. That was a beautiful stroke. Breathe out. That was a beautiful stroke. Swivel. Now you looked up. Do it easy and don't look up. No, you looked up again. There. Tell me you wouldn't like that shot down the line. No, now you're muscling it. So here's the 